Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Super Mario Maker 2. Today, we're gonna to be checking out some popular courses that have been going on in the world of Mario Maker. Because of the new update, there have been tons of cool new courses that have been spotlighted, and I wanna check some of them out. So, if we check out the popular courses over this way and play them by top of this past week, because the update's not even a week old, there should be tons of new stuff regarding some of the bunches and bunches of new power-ups that have been added to the game. You can see this one right here, it's very specifically version 3.0. So I'm hoping that we can check out at least the next top 10 popular courses. And if you guys have any cool version 3.0 update levels you want to let me know about, feel free to let me know about them. <laughs> Anyways, we got the boomerang trial over this way. Looking cool. I can't read a single word of this. Not in a language I speak, unfortunately. But I think the boomerang ability was a new one added. There were so many that I, I've sort of gotten them all uh, forgotten. <laughs> I've gotten them all mixed up at the least. But that's great because I can experience them here with you guys. So, uh, yeah, here's the boomerang, Mario. I don't remember if this was in the game before, but it's here now, and as you can see, you can just do this. Oh, that let me through. So this is like a puzzle level. Oh, cool. Um, What do I do? Oh, you know what? Maybe I wasn't supposed to do that twice. <laughs> Maybe I broke it. There we go. Uh, go back over this way. Maybe make the thwomp mad, if I can. It didn't really do much. Hmm. I think I'm supposed to... There we go. No? Or maybe I could, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. <laughs> this is a little confusing. I'm running out of time. Um, oh, there we go, I just have to run right up to it. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Just have to figure it out. See, the Boomerang Mario is really cool already. Uh, okay, that got rid of that guy. Can I just now, oh, that'll work. Sweet, all right. Uh, I don't know what I do about you. Oh, I gotta time this just right so that those don't get blocked. Wow, that is so cool. Now let's go up this way. I always love little puzzle mini game levels like these. They're always, these are a lot of fun. Oh, I gotta get rid of you, don't I? Gotcha. Then the bob -um goes through, he gets lit up, he'll explode all the pow blocks. Gotta watch out. And there we go, awesome. Keep running, go through here because the Boomerang Mario is actually in Mario th Mario 3D World, so that's really cool to see it here. Oh, you know what, I'm think I don't think, oh, I see. There we go. So with that out of the way, let's try this one out. Wait, what? Why did it do a little, oh, was there only, oh, I see, I was only supposed to do it for one of them. Weird. Hmm, that might be a bit time consuming. But I guess that's what I'm supposed to do. All right, I might need that boomerang back. <laughs> I guess, yeah, just keep chipping away at it. We'll get there eventually. Come on, almost there. Couple more blocks to get rid of. And got it. Because some of the power-ups added, I can't wait to see, have not been in a Mario game before. They seemed like totally new, so that was exciting. I definitely wanna, I wanna take a look at that. Wait, what do we do here? Oh, I see. Gotta time it just right. Whoa, look at that. That's awesome. So now, with that, I can turn this back on, go through the door, and have we reached the end? This is a really long level. Oh no, watch it. So once again, we gotta time this just right. Or maybe we don't? Oh, would you look at that? That's weird. Very interesting execution for that. Hmm. There we go. But I don't have a key for this. Oh, I see. Gotta keep at it. There's another one. And got it. This level just keeps going. I love it. So I guess what we gotta do for this one is throw it through like that, hit that, hit this. Oh, that was almost too late. Very, very close. Run, 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 I don't know what's going on. Wait, what does it say? Boss, uh-oh, I don't like that. Who are we facing off? It's Boom Boom and a Wiggler. And not a Wiggler, a Lakitu, not a Lakitu. What, 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 who is that? Um, That's a Pokey. There we go, we got him. Also, this is like really the boss fight. Oh, this is scary though, I don't like it. He's closing in on me. Oh my gosh, hold on. No, oh, no. There we go. And it falls at like different speeds each time. It was getting close. Wait, where am I going? Did I do it? Game. 
Clear. I thought that said Oreo. I don't know why I thought it said Oreo. Game Oreo. All right, well, I don't have any Oreos. That's okay, because we do have the level completed. Oh, is there something over there? Oh, I guess we're gonna find out. What does that say? End. Oh, that's so cool. Awesome, so that was a fantastic start to today's episode. Maybe that's why I should start from level 10 to make my way up. <laughs> I don't know, but I like it. So let's move on to the next one now, which should be level number two, right over this way. So, uh, run away from Wiggler. Will do, so this is Wiggler, not the other guy. <laughs> so I don't know how new this level is, but maybe it has some new things with the update. It's in the Super Mario World theme. Oh, I already like it, Dash! And this is the Mario Kart music. I just played this game a couple months ago. Whoa, yeah, that's right, I forgot about this. This is the brand new P-Block move. Whoa, look at this! <laughs> it sort of looks like he's tooting. So this is a whole lot more different. Oh my gosh, they are, are all chasing us right now. They are not happy. This is a lot different than it used to be in the original Super Mario World. It was very difficult con to control in that game. But this, it's, it's a lot more interesting. Whoa. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Just tap the button a bunch. Oh. Go, 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 go. I like this though, oh no. But it's very bouncy once we hit the corner. So that's something you gotta be super duper careful about. And I don't know what happens if we get hit. We might lose our ability and then we'd fall. We'd plummet. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Balloon Mario making his way through. This is so awesome now. I love it. There's gonna be so many cool level ideas with this. I can't wait. I really, really can't wait. Um, Moving over this way now. Go, 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 go. Faster, faster, faster. Okay, whoa, had a little bit of a drift there. I don't know if tapping the button faster actually helps too much, but I'm trying it. It doesn't seem like it. This is so cool. I can't wait to just check out all the different level ideas people have going on here. Oh no, oh no, oh no, we got it! Awesome, so first try and everything we got through. That's a really, really cool level. Super smart with it. And just a fun power up to use too, so definitely that one I actually like a little bit better just because I really like that power up a lot. So we're going to exit to the next level now. And that will be level number three, Voc Vocaloid? Vocaloid? I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, I don't know what this is. Maybe it's like a music thing? Maybe, we'll find out. It says Y and right, so I guess we gotta run. Oh! Yeah, it's like a song. I don't recognize the song, but it's pretty cool. Hey, was that it? No. <laughs> okay, that was really cool. <laughs> Short but sweet, I like it. So there we go, there was the Vocaloid song. I didn't really hear any vocals. I mean, I, of course, it's really hard to add those in a Mario Maker course, but I thought that was awesome. So with that one done, that was a quick one. We have level number four, run away from the Wiggler. Wait, wait, again? It's the same level twice. What's different about this one? Uh, they look exactly the same. 6,000 people played this one. 57,000 people played this one. Maybe I'll skip this and we'll just move on to the next one. Like maybe there was something wrong with this one or something. Uh, we'll just move on and we'll do 11 levels or we'll get to the 11th level. Anyways, Transformer Mario. This is what I've been looking forward to. Version 3.0 and it looks like it's using a number of the different new power-ups. So that's super exciting. It's on the 3D World theme. So there's even more on top of this. There's even a brand new uh, Mario Bros. 2 themed power up in the original Mario Bros. So what's going on with this? We hit the pow block. Version 3.0, yeah! And of course, if you didn't see last episode, we checked out the brand new world feature. That was so much fun, that was a big thing. Wow, so yeah, here are different power ups. Uh, this one is the Goomba. So this is like a really nice introduction to some of the new power ups. Boom, <laughs> we're a Goomba now. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Um, yeah, what does this really do? I don't know, but we blend in with our fellow Goombas. And we can get a good couple of coins, I suppose. All right. And can I get, oh, I can still get hurt by Goombas now. That's not good. Ah, but now they're attacking me. Now they're trying to chase me down. I gotta be careful. No, 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 no. 
<laughs> okay. I gotta be a bit stealthier this time. Okay, so as you can see, they don't think anything of it. I'm just an abnormally large Goomba with blue little legs. I like it. Oh, and even the Thwomps don't attack me. I am totally undercover. They just think I'm one of Bowser's minions. That's cool. All right. Very stealthy. Uh-oh. Hey. <laughs> he'll just stand there. Boom! Didn't see that coming, did ya? Now he'll attack me, though. Now he's not so happy. Or will he? Wow! He still is none the wiser. That's crazy. All right. Oh, no. Yeah, he's just chilling out over there. He doesn't know what to do. All right, well, this game just got a whole lot easier. That's awesome. Okay, so what's this about? Okay, now we're big Goomba. We have the longest Goomba legs of all time. Wait, I didn't get any of the stuff. Oh, oh okay, I think I got one of them, and maybe I'll get, wait, what's happening here? I think I need to be small Mario to get through here. Yeah, all right. Um, But yeah, I think that I get one pink coin for every uh, power-up we check out. So this one I'm excited for as well. This is the Bullet Bill hat. And if I remember correctly, uh, yeah, we can fly around like a bullet bill. Wow, but when we let go of the button and then press it again, we fall in a way that's a little bit scary. So if I go back, I can get some coins. And then, you gotta be quick with it. Oh no, no, I ran out of juice. Okay, no, no, why'd you do that to me? Oh, come on, I was just, why, why'd you gotta do that? <laughs> oh wow, bit of a risk with that one. That's A-OK -okay with me, we'll hop on in there again. And this time, I probably shouldn't worry too much about coins. I have infinite lives here, so. Whee! Okay, we did it. And then, how do I? Whoa, okay. And doing that actually gets rid of the hat. This is really cool. It's just so different. And I'm pretty sure that wasn't in 3D World at all. Oh, was that it? Okay, this one was super easy. All right, all right. Yeah, that's not gonna work. So let's get through there again and try out the next level. Cause there's still four more to go. This one over here is the boomerang, which of course we've had a bit more experience with now. So we can throw that through the pipe, boom. And then I guess, uh, yeah, I throw it over this one. While it's traveling, I can get up this way. I don't quite know what this one will do for me, but I guess I can get up no, no, no. Yeah, it's telling me to get up somewhere. Huh. Oh, I see, I didn't see these before. Got it. So try that again. Oh, give me some coins, I appreciate it. Even if I don't really need them. And with that, we should, wow, they're bouncing everywhere now. I should be able to, um, yeah, get to this next area. Oh, this is all about timing, huh? Let's hope that my timing was good. There we go. Very fancy. And there we go, that is going to be, oh, there was no pink coin for this one? No, I, I think I just got it, like right away. I just didn't notice. So we're at three out of uh, six now. So three more left to find. We can do it. See, so yeah, I'm curious to see what we got next, because I'm not really sure. Oh, it's the POW block. So same thing with the other ones, you wear this on your head, and I think you can just choose one to explode. Uh, or maybe I have to head bonk something to actually get it to explode. It's a little weird. Yeah, it looks like anytime I bump into something. So I can't just choose when it goes off. I have to be able to have something to knock my head against. But even a normal wall works like that. Any kind of surface, really. Yep, cool. And then over this way, get up like that. And let's get through the door. So I'm very impressed with the power up so far. Oh, am I supposed to get rid of the red Koopa? Is that sort of the, the trick here? I don't know, or maybe it's just all of them. <laughs> I like this. Uh, come on, come on. Got it, and then, there we go, I got them all, hooray! And that was it. <laughs> I think we got the key for getting rid of the red one, though. So there we go, there is another pink coin, and I'll have to uh, <laughs> do that, get hurt, and just get through. So two more like little levels to get through. What are they going to be? Cool. 
Oh, we got the propeller box. Yeah, this was in Mario 3D Land as well, which we played that game last year. That was a lot of fun. Was that last year or was that two years ago? I think that was last year. Time has been going by very quick, but also very slow. Oh, it's a little bit different than the propeller cap though, or even just how it worked in the original game. As you can see, there's like three uses for it, but I guess when you land, they get restored. So you can do that three times, interesting. I like that, that'll definitely be different. So there's really no maximum on how many uses you can get out of it. There we go, got rid of them. Let's go down this way. And what was up there? Something secret? Oh, something secret, I don't really need it, but I'll take it. Yeah, I really like that. That's gonna be fun for some platforming challenges, having that propeller cap work the way it does, because that'll be a little bit different than it does in the new Super Mario Bros. theme as well. So lots of cool stuff going on. All right, so we need to become small Mario again. And then, oh, what is this one? I actually don't know, is it like a cannon? I think it's a cannon. Yeah, look at that, oh, that's awesome. I like it. I don't know how many, oh, I can charge it up to. You guys are in trouble. Can I launch it through here? You bet I can. And what's going on up this way then? Boom, oh, I can't quite do that, that's unfortunate. But I can at least tell you to go away that way. That's awesome. Oh no, oh no, Bowser Jr.? Where? Oh, I see. Come on, come on. There we go. And then I can hit that, maybe. It didn't, maybe because I charged it up? Oh, I can just go through. <laughs> I'm being silly. Wait, what? Why? There we go. So I guess charging it up does let it go farther. Weird. For sure. So, yeah, what am I doing now? I guess I just go through that. Well, there we go. And that is the final pink coin. Very exciting. So going back this way. Oh, did I just get teleported somewhere? You bet I did. Uh, so let's get this and thank you. You're welcome. I will get to use everything one last time, really some of it one last time. Very, very cool. That was an awesome level for sure. Just being able to check everything out. Had a lot of fun with it. So we're not quite done, but that was a fantastic step forward, learning all the different 3D World items that have been added to the game. And like I said, there were still other power-ups that were added. Uh, Rickety Rune, interesting. So this one was added a good while ago. So this one definitely isn't a new power-up or anything like that, anything from version 3.0. But this is find five red coins in a fragile ruin. Collect them all and find the treasure. So this is a Mario 3 level, which I haven't played in a while, so this will be fun. But yeah, there's different bob We're supposed to be finding the five different coins. Whoa, watch it. There's one of them, but we haven't really found too much. Oh gosh, I can interact with just yet to get any of them. Maybe we have to like go through it once and then go backtrack through it, I guess, might be the idea. But hey, that gives us a good idea about like what's, oh no, <laughs> coming up. Should have swung into that a little bit more. Interesting so far. But I like the layout of everything. Yeah, definitely, there's nothing around here I can interact with. Just gotta be very careful not to get taken out like that, uh, because that's just not fun to deal with. Oh boy. Whoop, yeah, okay, be careful, be more careful. Here we go, so, don't make the same mistake twice. And also don't, ah, I knew I was gonna do that. <laughs> Silly me. There we go, okay. Oh, this is tricky. This is really tricky, but we got it. Gotta keep moving now. Here is, oh, thank goodness, the checkpoint. That is, oh, oh, so interesting. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no, wait, 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 I wasn't, I wasn't ready. I get it now. So they give you a really tough level, but they do give you some time to scope it all out and prepare. Very interesting. So boom, do that. And then we gotta move fast because if not, our flooring is gonna disappear. Oh, <laughs> yikes. Oh, I gotta be getting the coins too. So you know what? It's good that I messed up there. And it's also good I have as many tries as I need to have 
I don't like how we get stuck there for a second. It just makes it so we have even less time to get moving. So right there, I need to grab this coin real fast. Oh, move it. No, that darn. What is his name? Dry Bones. Dry Bones is his name. He just keeps getting in the way. That That is really tough. Come on, try again. Go, go, go. Get up this way, just like that. Keep moving now, keep moving. Oh no, no, I did it again. I'm panicking because the floor is going away as we speak. There we go, God no! <laughs> I had some good momentum going on too. Gotta be careful that flop. He's a tough one. So let's try this again, turn around and then boop. And I did it at just this right angle before where I actually didn't get stopped by the block at all either. Couldn't recreate it this time. Okay, ready? Go for it. Ah, darn. There's like just the right jumping momentum timing where you can get some really good movement going on. You can just get it done the first time. But if not, you have to sort of swing around. So it's really tough, requires a lot of trial and error. And that's where I'm very happy that I don't have to worry about. There we go. Okay, quickly. Because I don't think I can even complete the level without the pink coin. So you really got to make sure you don't forget those. I've already gotten more than half of them. And here's another one. Slide down there, jump over that. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that's all of them. So how am I getting out of here? We're so much farther ahead of the, 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 the plant. Whew, did we do it? We did it! That was a cool level. Really, really fun. I love the idea, excellent execution. Very difficult, but just the right kind of difficulty. Not too long of a level either, so we could just try it over and over again. And there we go. So that was level number six, I think, out of the 11 we'll be doing. Uh, mini game, fireball shooting. So this one's also a new level, I think. Because version 3.0, yeah, launched on April 22nd. So uh, this is April 23rd. Use fireballs to hit bob bombs, which makes you progress, makes you, which makes you prog progress. Have fun. Will do. So maybe this has something to do with the new update. Maybe it doesn't. It could just be a, a normal level. Not really sure. But no matter what, I'm excited to have fun with it. Oh boy. So we're going into some kind of like big cave fortress kind of thing here. And here's our fire flower. Wow, that's cool. Okay, try again. Oh, I gotta time it up with the booze. Oh, this is so interesting. Whoa. All right. That is tough. Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. I think it'll be easier when it's on its way up. There we go. Oh no, now it's even more complicated. But we got it. Oh no, that is some crazy timing. So it's not really about positioning at all, it's all about timing. Oh no. Come on, that's it. Yeah, nice. Those boos are all over the place. Whoa, just barely weaved in between them. Excellent. So I don't, yeah, we have plenty of time luckily. So I think we'll be able to get through this okay. So there's all that, and was that all of them? It might have been. Or maybe there'll be more. Uh, we'll grab this checkpoint, and we'll see what's going on with this door. It's very visually confusing. I feel like I just went in a big circle. But now, now I'm on this side. Whoa. Whoa, okay, we got it. Oh, this one, gotta bounce it off the same block? Not really, I thought, I thought we did, but we don't. That's really tough to do. Um, I'm trying to find just the right timing for it. I mean, like I could just constantly do this and eventually it works. I feel like that's cheating now. I'd like to avoid doing that. Okay, ready, boom. Yeah, there it is. Whoa, whoa, scary eyes. Boo, boss, I thought I said boo. Oh man, oh yeah, that's right, they added the Koopalings. How did I forget that they added the Koopalings? They added the Koopalings, guys. And I think it's in all themes as well. So yeah, the Koopalings are now in the game. I really hope it's all in all themes. We're just trying to beat a Boom Boom here um, while Ludwig, two Ludwigs are attacking us. This is so cool. I can't wait to see more levels with these guys because they're awesome. There we go, we got the key. So let's get up there quick, but dodge that. I haven't taken any damage. I wanna keep it that way. Oh boy. So what's next? Over this way, boom, going through the blue pipe. Is that it? Is there more? Oh wow, okay. GG, good game. All right, we did it! That was so much fun! 
really crafty level. We've been seeing some top tier experiences in today's episode, and there's still more to come, so that's awesome. So next up we have level number eight, my friend is enemy. And I'm gonna guess, well actually I was gonna say that maybe this is one where we have the Goomba, but I don't know, because that was a Mario 3D World power up. So I don't know what's going on with this one. So we'll try it out together, we'll see. Help, oh we gotta help the little Goomba up there, no problem buddy, there we go. Oh and we get to work together. Thanks, <laughs> that's so cute, you're welcome. Uh. Oh wow, so we just have to keep exploring with him, I suppose. There we go, give him a little spring to his step, and boom, we can keep moving forward. So we'll just keep helping each other out like buddies. Oh no, oh no, no wait! Oh no, he's fine, he's fine. <laughs> he doesn't get hurt by those things. Maybe there's something he can do for me though. That'd be good, because I can't quite just walk on, the oh, I see. Well there we go, we get to keep moving together. Go, I'm trying. Uh oh, uh oh, wait. Was that a trap? I hope not. Oh, 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 there we go. <laughs> well, we're getting through this together, little Goomba buddy. Oh, there we go. Wait, is that right? I guess not. Um, What do we do now? Oh, wow. Oh, that's scary. But we can make it work. Wait, what? why didn't he jump? I pressed the jump button, <laughs> he just fell off. There we go, I got through it this time. So let's bounce him up there. <laughs> Very fascinating level so far. Um, I'm guessing I need that. So that's a little bit tricky, but boom, press the button, you can keep moving. And I'm guessing this will make another vine for us to get up. Oh no, it makes a spring. Alrighty. Oh, can I use these? Aha! Alrighty. Wow, I didn't realize that those got rid of that. And they're still spinning. Hmm. What do I do here? Oh, I stand on this, don't I? Gotcha. Whoa, oh, I thought that was gonna hurt me. I didn't like it. So what do we, oh, I see. There we go. I was a little confused there, but I can just jump up and hit the block. So yeah, me and this Goomba are best of pals right now. He helps me, I help him. I think we've had a level like this before, but it wasn't with a, a door. All right, sure. Um but it wasn't with a Goomba, I don't think. I think it was something else. Bye! No, don't do it! We were such good friends! Ah! <laughs> the dramatic suspense. Oh no! Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, hold on, hold on. Do something! Don't just stand there and let me get beat up by Bowser Jr. I'm stuck in this room all alone. Well, not all alone, but. Oh, get him! Get him! He'll, he'll never suspect his own minion. Whoa! <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh no, but he sacrificed himself. That's sort of a shame, that makes me sad. What a good friend. Even when he had to act like he wasn't our friend to surprise Bowser Jr. This is eerily silent. Aw, <laughs> he's got little feathers. He's an angel now. Well, thank you, Mr. Goomba. You are a great friend. Oh, this song is from, oh, what's the game called? Mother 3. What does that say? Eh. Enemy. Aw. Well, you know what? Even though he might have been labeled an enemy, he was actually a friend. That's so sweet. It's so sad, but it's so sweet too. Bye. <laughs> the end. What a touching tale. I absolutely love it. Well, like I said, what amazing levels we've stumbled upon today. I'm really enjoying it. That might be one of my favorites ever. <laughs> Just the heartfelt felt little tale of it. Uh, so let's go on to level number nine, speed run with a turtle. <laughs> so we're going from some heartfelt action to maybe some speedy action. It, yeah, okay, whatever. <laughs> 30 seconds to get through this one. Um, and once again, as we always do with these kind of levels, gotta follow the coins. Oh, this reminds me of Mario. Wow, that hurt. Was I not supposed to do that? I guess, I don't think I was fast enough. Um, but this reminds me of Mario 64, because of course there are, there's a Koopa you can race in that game, um, in some of the levels, and only like one or two of them, but it's still really a memorable star. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I messed it up big time. Oh, big time. <laughs> Gotta try that again. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to play that game. I plan on playing it really, really soon. 
It's been on my to-do list for a very long time, Super Mario 64. I've just been so busy with so many projects, especially so many new games coming out. I just haven't gotten to it ever, but I think the time is coming up soon. I, why did I do that? <laughs> I don't know. One more time though. This time we got it. Big jump. All over the place. Got it. Oh man. Yeah, if you don't do that just right on the swing, you just don't get enough speed. There we go. I don't know what's happening right now. Jump! Oh my gosh. Uh, ah, okay, major money. Wait, wait, what? I think I was supposed to bounce off him, but he moved out of the way. Oh, that stinks. There we go. Whoa! I don't even know what we do with that key. It was just, it was just fancy. That was awesome. I loved it. Alrighty, so we beat the Koopa in the big race. It was very close down to the line, but we were the victor. Really fun level. I always like it when the race levels are very ingenuitous. Ingen ingenuitive. 4-2 uh, Snowball Shuffle. 4-2 of Super Mario Generation. So I guess this person must have made a world. Maybe we'll explore that at some point. Maybe they've made a full game that we can explore. That'd be cool. But we'll, we'll use this as a little taste tester if we want to check that out at some point. Um, oh, this is so snowy. I love it. Can I jump on top of these guys? I don't think so. So I don't want to risk it. Even if they have a little hat. Or maybe... I have a snowball. Oh no, I can, all right. Yeah, I guess now is the time to risk it if I was going to. Ah, uh, didn't really make that happen perfectly. But that's fine. And there's a vine. Whoa, <laughs> that was just clumsy of me, sorry. But hey, I, I learned my lesson. Now we can uh, try again. Just wanna hop on top of you like that, get myself a mushroom. And then with this snowball, I didn't even know this was a thing, really. Unless this is a new thing with the update, but I don't think so. There we go. Boom. Get some extra coins, why not? Perfect. And with this one, oh no. Oh no, did I mess up my chances? I sure hope not. What do I do now? Oh no. I don't have any more snowballs. So that's the tough part about this level then, is if you mess up, I guess you just gotta Die and try again. That's not good. So I really gotta make the most of that jump. Oh, can I pick this up? I can't, but luckily I can at least knock them to the point where I can reach up here. Oh gosh, oh gosh, major jumps. This is a very tricky level. You really don't get too much rooms, room in terms of mistakes, no! I'm so glad I just got the checkpoint then. Wow. Okay, hop back down. Oh no! Oh no, not again! I wish there was a way to get more snowballs because that would just be nice, but gotta try that again, it's fine. Luckily, once again, we have infinite lives, so that's always a good thing about playing the course maker this way, or the course explorer, or whatever it is. Darn, tough little jump to make. But definitely, if this this is still a very quality level, I would be interested in checking out this person's full world. Ah, that. The, the throwing of the snowballs feels a little different than of different objects you can throw in uh, Mario 3. Oh no, why did I, oh no, I could stand on that. I <laughs> At least I make it slightly farther with every mistake, right? Okay, boom, boom. Keep running. Ah, uh, yeah, okay, we did it. No, we didn't do it. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. It gets very scary, but we made it. I don't know what's next. Is there more? Oh, there's more. And we still haven't gotten another, ah, oh, checkpoint. You, you can't make a single mistake in this level or you, you just gonna fall to your doom. So far, so good. I haven't been talking because I've been so focused. Ah, I don't like it. Is there more snowballs? That was it. Okay, we made it. Very, very challenging. But we made the most of it. And we got there. So there we go, course clear. How many more courses do we have left over? Uh. Snow jungle speed run. Okay, this is the last one we want to do for today's episode. 70 seconds to run through the snow jungle. Let's see how it goes. Follow the coins. I've been saying that this whole time. <laughs> it looks like the description of this level agrees with me. Okay, let's go for it. Oh no, oh no, boop, got it. And it looks like we also have to get these pink coins. There's a lot of them too. I didn't know you could have that many in one level. I like it. So we'll keep running. Gotta be careful, because that makes some of the coins fall. I really hope that doesn't make us 
accidentally get rid of the pink coin at some point. But we're already up to four of them. I guess there might be 10 in total. Was I supposed to get the fire flower there? I don't really know. Um, weird. Just gonna keep running though. Whoa! Had the slide down that. So far, it is indeed very snowy. Awesome. Come on, keep going. I wanna get this all done in one try. That'd be awesome as well. Perfect. And go down the pipe. Keep going, Mario. See, there's another fire flower. I guess you just can't get those. I didn't know. Wait, have we gone in a circle? No. Okay, there we go. So we got all pink coins. I guess you don't really need them. I didn't see anything where we'd have to go through a door. But yeah, we did it. Awesome. So that was a ton of fun. 10 different levels. I know that we got to level 11 because that's because we skipped a repeat for some reason. But yeah, 10 amazing levels, most of them covering uh, the brand new stuff that was in version 3.0. Let me know which level was your favorite. And if you have any levels to suggest, I would love to hear about them. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Super Mario Maker 2. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.